And the first day of school is still several days away, but for many student athletes, practice is already underway. 23 ABC's Rupi Rivera shows us how the football program at East Bakersfield High works to keep players safe while training in the summer heat. Whether you play tennis, football, or soccer, concerns about the heat are always an issue. If you're a student athlete at East Bakersfield, you might be expected to get up as early as 5.30 in the morning. An idea led by the school's football coach who says sometimes this is their safest option. They, they adjust very well, but it's how you approach it. I, I believe that if you get out of the heat and start things early, you can avoid it as much as possible. Sometimes you can avoid it but we do the best we can to avoid. BB Carrasco has been the head football coach at East High for the last three years. However, he's been coaching for 26 years. He says in his time being coach, pushing practice to be done in the morning has been the best solution in ensuring the kids' overall safety. However, he says when school's in session, this isn't always an option. Be here at 5.30 in the morning, then they have to go to school, but you know, so we start right after practice at, right after school, and we try to go after school, little study hall maybe, little weight lifting afterwards, and then we have to start practice 6 o'clock, 7 o'clock. Sometimes we don't have no choice but to go late at night. 16-year-old Alex Newkirk is about to enter his junior year, and he's also on the school's football team. Newkirk says he's gotten used to the early morning routine and appreciates the work Coach Carrasco does for the team. With the good coaching staff and good coaches and everything, they let time in for tons of water breaks, and um, they, never, they never try to, like, work us too hard to a point where we start throwing up. They make sure we're, we're safe. Newkirk says there have been occasions where rather than practicing earlier, practice is canceled altogether. According to Kern High School District, that decision is based off the daily air quality index. These guidelines are sent out to every school in the district daily in order to better ensure a student's overall health. Mom Lacey Newkirk says she's very appreciative of the coach's efforts, and although the switch schedule may not be ideal for parents, it's about the kids' overall health. The games have been pushed back several hours, so instead of playing at 6 in the heat of the day, we were now starting at eight. So, you know, it's a sacrifice because now you're going to get out of there at 10, but at least you're all the kids aren't like falling over. Coach Carrasco says safety is always his number one concern. However, even in the heat, he tries to make each practice as engaging as possible to try and get the kids out of that lethargic feel. We don't want them to overheat. We don't want them to get, you know, have a heat stroke out here. So we really, we have to be very cautious about that. We can't just look at a kid and say, you know, oh, he's not trying hard or, he, you know, every kid is different. Coach Carrasco says he is always looking for ways to better support kids in the heat. However, he wants to remind them that they know their bodies best. And while he wants everyone to push themselves, he wants them to be mindful of their limits. In East Bakersfield, Rubia Rivera, 23 ABC News, connecting you.